It has been a series of strikes and back and forth discussions as junior doctors sought answers regarding their delayed internship deployment. The doctors were supposed to be deployed on April 3rd. Previously, the government had cited financial constraints as the reason for the delay as they needed 80 billion shillings. The medical cadres were planning a massive strike on 1st August. The persistence of the junior doctors' protest seems to have resulted in a breakthrough, securing the opportunity for them to kickstart their careers as the Ministry of Health has now committed to deploy them. And we expect the medical interns to report starting on 3rd August. The Ministry of Health has also issued a deploy, a deployment list it may be remembered that when the matter of deployment was discussed in Parliament on 19th July, the Speaker Anita Among proposed a reduction in the allowances and promised that this would be discussed. I'm saying we need a stakeholders meeting so that we know we can decide to reduce from 2.5 to maybe 1 million shillings so that you are able to accommodate everybody. Whereas the announcement brings relief that finally the junior doctors can proceed with their lives, one major concern revolves around the revised terms of payment. While interns initially received 2.5 million shillings, the figure has been revised to a net monthly allowance of 1 million shillings. The revision in uh, the allowance for the medical interns to a net pay of 1 million Uganda shilling was occasioned, was occasioned by inavailability of funds and the figure that is revised is what has been communicated in the clearance for us to be able to deploy them uh, to the various internship training centers. But as long as the president himself has not receded or uh, removed his directive of 2.5 million, as long as government gets enough money or the economy stabilizes, then the interns should be able to get the 2.5 million which the president directed because there was a reason as to why he directed uh, the 2.5 million and we don't wish to go back on that. In response to the concerns on the Ministry of Health Communication and the Repayment Resolution, the Uganda Medical Association, junior doctors and other medical cadres are scheduled to meet on Saturday to discuss the way forward. We shall discuss with the doctors and we see whether uh, we go ahead with the industrial action or not. Discussed whether we should accept for them for now to go and be deployed or not, whether we should accept the one million which has been offered or not. We do believe we are going to have a discussion about this entire process, of course with the Uganda Medical Association leadership and the Elders Council or Elders Forum. We forge a way forward. However, it remains to be seen if the pre-medical interns will be in agreement with government's resolution. Nobat Atkunda, NTV News.